So if anybody, you're new to Seattle, you should know that pro hockey is not new here in the Northwest. Hockey has played a pretty important role in Seattle sports for more than 100 years, not always at the major league level, but still it started with the Metropolitans back in 1915, the team that gave Seattle its first major sports championship, winning the Stanley Cup at the Seattle Ice Arena that was on the corner of Fifth Avenue and University Street. Became the first, again, American team to win the Stanley Cup. Now that was before the NHL existed, but still it counts in the record books. In 1928, the former Metropolitans, their coach brought in the Seattle Eskimos to play at Civic Ice Arena, which later became known as Mercer Arena. Then in 1933, the original Seahawks, different kind of Seattle Seahawks, but Seahawks nonetheless. Fast forward to 1948, you got the Seattle Ironmen, which would be renamed a couple of times until finally becoming the Totems. That's one of the names that a lot of people are thinking the hockey team might be in a couple of year here, years here. And they actually beat Calgary in the 1959 President's Cup. So congratulations to them. And the Totems, by the way, then moved into the Coliseum, now Key Arena in 1964, bringing in about 10,000 fans per game with no helmets necessary back in the 1950s. After that, the hockey team became the Breakers from 1977 through 1985, playing at Mercer Arena. 1990, Seattle took kind of a shot at the uh, big time at the NHL, but Bill Ackerley, the son of Barry Ackerley, backed out of the officers. So since 1985, we've had the Thunderbirds, who have sent, like we just talked about, a lot of guys to the NHL. They play in Kent, and again, an NHL team is coming here in the fall of 2021.